everyone. I hope you're doing well. This is a touch of tarot and today the topic is why did your special person, the DM, fall in love with you? I say DM because most viewers are female, uh, but DM is just an energy. Okay, so why did your person fall in love with you is the topic. Why did your person fall in love with you? I was going to say how, but I feel like why did they fall for you, okay? What captivated their heart for you? Let's begin. Okay, I'm going to cut the deck first is what I'm getting here, and then we start here. So we have the five of wands. And as you see, this is someone in some sort of a community setting, um, prayer, love. You may have met this person at church, a church, at church. You may have met this person on a beach even. Um, they may have fallen in love with you because there was something different about you than all the other people. If you are dealing with the masculine, there's three women here and one masculine and one woman has her hat over her head. So you may have been more conservative. You may have um, been very focused and just not really like opening up that much. You know what I mean? Like you are open, you're in a community, you're holding others hands, but you still keep to yourself. So um, this person may have fallen in love with you there. I feel like what happened is there was something different about you. There was other people around. Um, but I feel like these two, this one that's covered and this person are literally looking each other in the eyes. I feel like this woman's looking at her. Maybe, you know what I mean? Anyhow, point being, there was something different about you. And this is what started um, this love interest with this person. I'm also seeing two cats playing on the ground. So you may have, or he or she may have felt like they knew you from past lives, okay? Like you've had many lives together, okay? So let's see what else we get as to why this person fell in love with you. Why did this person fall in love with you? So we have the Queen of Cups. I feel like when this person met you, they knew right away that they wanted to be with you. They may have also known right away that you and um, they made a contract in a past life to be together at some point or to never forget each other, to always um, hold this connection dear, right? Why did this person fall in love with you? This could be because you were this divine feminine energy. Once again, I'm getting this message like you're different than other people. There's something you do different, maybe with your hair, maybe with the way you dress, maybe with the way you just carry yourself. I also get that you don't, I feel like there is some sort of privacy to you or some sort of like, you don't just give it all out in the beginning or say everything. There's something very attentive and aware about you. You're paying attention to what's going on. Um, you think before you speak. I think this person also saw you as a very strong soul, a very independent energy. And this is part of the reason they fell in love with you. But I'm also getting you're very intense, okay? There's something intense about you. So, like, even if you're a community person, you're a leader in the community, or there's something where people look to you for advice, um, and you're not afraid to share it from the heart. So this person, you're probably an empath as well. There's something here where this person really feels you're able to connect and still be strong but connect okay so why else did this person fall in love with you we have the five of chalices um and what i get is that this person sees that you easily allow things to go so for some of you this is someone that like you know if this person left you said goodbye. You said, okay, I can I can go elsewhere. I'm not going to suffer. I'm not going to dwell on this. I may seclude myself, put my cover over my head and go within, um, but I'm not going to worry about that because really there's an energy to you that you always have options around you. This person found that very attractive. I do feel that this person um, may have left your life at some point and you just let it go and this person came right back in. Um, they, it may have taken some time, right? But this person, they see something within you. There's something very special. So no matter if they left, they get guided back to you. I do feel like they were gone some time though. Okay. 
So what does this person find, find attractive? Why did they fall in love with you? Um, they fell in love with you because you hung on even during the storms, even when times got rough, um, even when there was no communication, even when this person was at a snail's pace or at a turtle's pace, you hung on during the difficulties. Okay. I really do feel that. I do feel that this has gone on for some of you over some, uh, quite a long period of time. Okay. So that's sad, but that's what I'm getting here. What else does this person feel? Why do they fall in love with you? The Knight of Swords. Um, you soar, you fly, you go for what you want. You have your eye on the prize. When, like you're able to um, move out of bad situations, I guess, with the devil here quickly as well. You're e you easily let go of bad situations. You don't dwell on things. You don't hang on for too long. You just hang on long enough for it to pass, and then you're out. So there's something to that energy that this person fell in love with you, why they fell in love with you. Also because... Um, you may have helped them see just how empty they were, something like that. Now, here's the star card. Like, there's something that you uh, sparked in them for them to take a look at their own reflection. Um, and so this helped them fall in love with you. It probably goes back to that past life connection I feel you have with this person. Okay, so let's see why else this person fell in love with you. Okay, I don't know why, but I want to see whatever that was because it came out really strong. The hangman. So it's about attitude. So this person fell in love with you, and it, like, you know, right here with the tree, um, because of your attitude when things get tough, when you're stuck in a situation, something about your attitude. You're still, you know, you still keep on keeping on type of thing. And we have the five of shells in reverse. So you don't hang on to regrets. Remember I said, because we have the five of shells here, five of cups. You don't hang on to things like if someone's leaving, you're like, go, you know what I mean? Um, this person finds that you don't hang on to disappointments. This person finds that very attractive and that's the reason they fell in love with you. One of them. Um, so you have patience. This person finds the fact that you're patient, you are strong, you are powerful, um, you're nurturing. This is part of the reason they fell in love with you. And remember I said, like you stuck around even when things got rough. I believe I said that, like you hung on during the storms. Um, so the six of cups again, oh no, it's not the six of cups. It's the six of wands actually. Okay. So victory, um, you're victorious. You get what you go for. You go for what you want and you have some sort of magic to you. So this is how this person fell in love with you. Maybe they met you at a work setting and, or know about your accomplishments. I mean, you are coming up as queen energy they find it very attractive and they fell in love with you. One more card from this deck. This person fell in love with you, the chariot. So determined energy, motivated energy, reaching for the star energy. What's not attractive about a caring, nurturing, motivated energy? This person really finds that attractive and fell in love with you because you don't give up. You don't give in to disappointments. You keep on going. Definitely a forgiver. Um, you just don't let other people upset you. Something like that. Like they can't even, you're just like, don't worry, hon. I forgive you. Look at that. Even here, it's like that hard energy. Um, but this is discovery. So this is the energy of someone who is constantly learning and discovering new things and going forward with matters of the heart. We have gratitude here. So of course, this person finds you very attractive. You follow your heart. You love all. You care for all. You do not judge. Um, this is why this person fell in love with you. What else? Why did this person fall in love with you? Okay, we have a bag coming out. So stars, you can manifest your every wish. So this is about someone um, that doesn't focus on, you know, the rain, on sadness, on the downpour of things that, you know, might might seem like a challenge. But instead you're like, no, I want it like this, 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 and this. And you probably get it as well. Okay. So you're very connected um, to the stars. Let's get another message here to see why this person fell in love with you. See what wants to come out. Himself is the energy here. 
um, this is a beautiful communication energy and four of wands type energy there. But this person fell in love with you because they can be themselves. Plain and simple. They can be themselves around you. Okay. This person fell in love with you uh, because, like I said, you get over the past, you move forward, you focus on what you do want, um, you easily put the past behind you, and you look for the new experiences. There's something very, very attractive with this. Maybe you didn't hold a grudge to this person as well when they maybe walked away or something like that. Instead, you just set yourself your sights on higher things that will bring you what you want. And this person finds that attractive. So they fell in love with you for these reasons. And I'm sure many, many, many more also getting that you are of service and all uh, great service to people. Like you help people, but also you may help family members or something like that. Or maybe you're just a part of your community. Like you have your own family you've created. Um, okay. So that's what I'm getting why this person fell in love with you. I'm going to leave it there and keep it kind of a simple reading for today's reading. I hope you have a great week ahead of you um, and a great, great night or whatever it may be where you are. Bye for now.